Hey there. Good morning. Hey, I'm your host, Jeff Ski Kinsey. Of course, you know that if you're watching this live on LinkedIn or Facebook as it goes out this morning. Words. Words matter. I was listening. Last night, I had the privilege of doing the evening dishes. And so I typically put something on an audible book. Or sometimes I use Kindle to play uh, Alexa to play a Kindle book. But I was listening, you know, I was listening to a particular chapter of a particular book that I've listened to literally a hundred times. If I've listened to it once or read it once, to me, read and listen are synonymous uh, in today's technologically advanced world. So I would guarantee to you, I've read or listened to this chapter more than 100 times. And there was a couple words in there that struck to my core. I mean, they went right to the quick. And this is a follow-up to the video I did yesterday. I said I was working on this uh, new, new issue of my newsletter on LinkedIn called Coffee with Ski. And I wanted to address a matter. And so this, this uh, let's call it passage of text information, in this case, spoken words, it's like, I never heard that before. And it reminded me, shout out to Bob Burry. It reminded me, uh, he did this great tribute to Zig Ziglar. And he talked about buying these cassette tapes back in the day. And he couldn't afford them, but he bought them anyhow. And his, and his buddies that were at this meeting where Zig was speaking said, look, we know you can't afford those tapes, Bob. And he says, why are you buying them? And he says, exactly. He said, that's exactly the reason I'm buying them. And he say, listen to these things over and over again. And I forget what time he said it was. Let's say 10th time. Doesn't, doesn't matter. But he listened to it a bunch of times. And all of a sudden, he heard something that just blew his mind. It was an answer he had been looking for. Okay. That happened to me yesterday. Now, the cool thing is I didn't have to pay quite as much for it. I remember those. I got a bunch of Zig Ziglar. I got the 50 Secrets. Is it 50 Secrets of Closing the Sale? Okay, I have the original cassette, I've got the Audible, I've got the Kindle book. <laughs> Anyhow, so here's the thing. Words matter. Okay, are the words that you're using, are they sharp enough to cut to the chase? That's the bottom line. Okay, and I am so guilty of not using words sharp enough to cut to the heart of the matter. Okay. Hopefully, you're going to see a much improved series of messages from me, like this one. This one has one topic, and I'm trying to stick to it. That's tough for me, okay, because I, I just spitball these things, right? I mean, just off the top of my head, you know, I run with it. But you're going to watch, you're going to listen, you're going to hear, you're going to see some stuff from me that's extremely focused. I'm going to be very careful about my word choices, because I want to convey to you something that has changed my course through business and life and how you can do the same thing. Because the, the times I, let's don't go there. Let's just say it's more important than ever. And if I can help, you have to reach out. You have not because you ask not. I mentioned that yesterday as well. So we're working on some cool projects we could use some help on. And again, I'm going to send out some notes to people saying, hey, you got any insight here? Can you help with this? And do likewise. Some of you remember my book, Purple Curve Effect. I have seven points I think would make a difference. One of them I remember or recall being step number four, involve others. Okay, you, you can't and you shouldn't do this alone. Okay, to me, business and success is a team sport, right? So put some amazing people on your team and get it done. And if I, if I can help, if I might be one of those, reach out. Fair enough. And I'll do likewise. And if you want to connect, direct message me here on LinkedIn or shoot me a text. Text me the word teamwork. Text the word teamwork to my mobile. 330-992-4754. Okay. And let's do this if you're in one of the 47 continental United States. Okay. I just assume California with all the craziness out there is broken away and fallen off into the ocean. Uh, so I can't help you out there. I mean, the craziness 
AB5, I mean, was like, well, and it even gets worse. It continues to amaze. So the rest of us, for the most part, in the 47 states, we understand that you need entrepreneurs. Okay, let's leave it at that. So if you're an entrepreneur and you need some help, reach out. I'm going to reach out to you. Remember, it's going to be just about as great a day as you make up your mind to make it. So join me and let's make it a fabulous day. Okay?